Yo, what's poppin'? It's your boy from the sea, the ATL Don checking in. You're watching Fitted Fame. Cause my sweat turned off right now. Kid friend looks going to turn off. Talkin' that talk, but it ain't about much. Hate no mess, cause the sweat turned off. This week on Fitted Fame, we have another special episode. This is another hat sale. It's the remainder of the stuff that didn't sell last time with some extra hats that have been added. Uh, there are a few hats I got in the $100 mystery box that I didn't know the names of the teams of, so... I want to clear that up right now. We're going to start off with the 7 and 5 eighths hats that are up for grabs. Alright, first off we got a Seattle Mariners throwback, which was made famous when Ken Griffey Jr. first broke into the league. Uh, this is a very different custom um, throwback from what you would see like at Lids and other places. The S is flushed. It's not unraised like how they currently do the hats. No new era logo. Please make a note of that. No major league logo on the back. Please make a note of that. It does have a green underbill. We'll not show you that due to the screen. It has a white sweatband. 7 to 5 8. New era. Cooperstown tagging. This retailed for. Honestly, can't read the price tag anymore. This brand new dead stock they ever worn. We're going to do this for 20 bucks plus five dollars shipping. It's going to be five dollars shipping per one hat. If you get multiple hats, this is a five dollar flat fee. So if you get five hats, for example, it's still five dollars shipping. So twenty dollars plus shipping. All right, the next one we got this in my mystery box, Seattle Pilots. Exact same colorway as the Seattle Mariners. Um, this does have the New Era logo on the sides, done in blue to blend in. No Major League logo. This also has a green underbill. Black sweatband, 758s. New Era tagging, Cooperstown. This is also dead stock, 758s once again. We're going to do this for 20 plus the shipping. Alright, now we got the Charleston River Dogs. This is probably not cooperating with my green screen. But uh, I believe this is, must have been some kind of uh, Hispanic Heritage game or something just due to the colorway. I can't find any information on it, on it online with a little bit of time I had before making this video. As you see, I'm wearing the same thing as I did in the Mystery Box video. We're knocking out a bunch of videos today. So you may see the same outfit for the next several videos just due to we're knocking out a ton of footage, alright? So, New Era flag done in black to blend in. MIL, MILB logos done in red, green, and outlined like metallic gold. Uh, gray underbill, black sweatband, 758. New Era tagging, minor league tagging. We'll do this one for 20 plus shipping. This retail for 40 bucks. Alright, we got the Atlanta Braves Diamond Era. Spring training hats, the first year they ever did special spring training hats. It has the Florida 2016 on the side. This is also the last year they made hats without the New Era logos on the side for the on-field hats. 758s, brand new dead stock. Black underbill, gray sweatband, 758s, New Era, authentic on-field collection. I've had this one for a while, been trying to move it. 15 bucks plus shipping. All right, we got this in the mystery box. Soccer team, the San Jose Earthquakes. I don't know anything really about soccer to be honest, but uh, got the logo done in red, white, blue, and black. Any logo done in black. San Jose Earthquakes with 1974 on the back, gray underbill. Black sweatband. This only has the size tagging and the new era tagging. Doesn't say anything about um, the soccer association. All right. Hopefully this one goes fast. This is your 2018 World Series champion, Boston Red Sox. This is a 2016 Diamond Era on-field um, batting practice hat. Brand new dead stock. Once again, 758s. Every hat I've showed you up to this point it is 758s. This is the final year of them making the on field hats without the new Aero logo on the side. 
You got the Major League logo done in the dark navy, white and red on the back. Uh, the Bills Navy, of course, logos, navy outline in white. Navy outlets, navy button. Camera probably can't pick it up, but the American League logo is uh, kind of a transparent type logo. I don't know the proper terminology I'm looking for right now. Um, that side, you got the gray sweatband, 758, new era. Authentic on-field collection. We also are going to do this one for 15 plus shipping. All right. Um, I didn't know the name of this one when I was doing the mystery box. Uh, the team is called the Albany Polecats. That's as much information as I know right now. This appears to be a very light gray to me. Or it could be white, but it's kind of hard to tell under the studio lighting. Black bill, black eyelets, black button. Any logos done in white, MILB logo, black and white, gray underbill, black sweatband, 758, New Era, Meyer League patching, 20 bucks plus shipping. All right, and this was also a Meyer League hat. I can't remember what team it was. I'm on the Hat Club website right now. To Some of these hats I got. Um, we're not on the website. It's like the team's called the Tulsa Drillers. It's a it's a labeled as a throwback. I don't know the major league affiliate that they're affiliated with. Uh, it's like a goldish yellow color, done with red with a star in the middle, red and E logo. The whole dome and bill is done in dark navy. MILB logo, navy, red, and white, has 918 on the side. I'm assuming that's probably the area code for where the team's located. Black underbill, black sweatband, 758 new era, minor league patching, 20 bucks plus shipping. All right, everything from here on out is going to be seven and a half. All right, this has been worn. It's Atlanta Braves black on black. And it's probably been worn, I would say, no more than two or three times. But uh, everything blacked out, some say murdered out. We'll do this for $5 plus shipping. All right, we got this maroon hat. I don't remember the terminology they use when they did the small logo down here in the corner. Once again, Atlanta Braves. It's Maroonish color, kind of like the University of Alabama type type maroon color. Got the NA logo white, Major League logo in the white and maroon, maroon underbill. This hat's been worn probably no more than two times. We're going we're going to blow these seven and a half hats out for a steal. Five bucks for that one plus shipping. All right, we got a urban style camouflage red white black and gray this is back from the no limit days when no limit was dominating with the no limit soldier movement uh a's done in black outline of white black and e logo major league logo done in black white and red black underbill black sweatband 758 new era official merchandise of the mob we're going to sell that one for five this is another blacked out, murdered out, whatever you want to call it. Old school brace hat with a little A. The other one had the big A. This has been worn probably two to three times. Everything's all blacked out. An E logo. This one has a feather on the back instead of the Major League logo, which is very different. I think this, this one came from Lids. Seven and a half. New Era. Cooperstown. Five bucks plus shipping. All right. Old school little A Braves hat, all red, white A, any logo, white, has Atlanta done in cursive, the way they used to do on the uniforms back in the early 80s. Black sweatband, 7 to 5 eighths, new era, official merchandise. This has probably been worn maybe two times. We're going to do that for five bucks. We're just trying to move this inventory. All right, this one has never been worn but I'm not a big fan of the new era stickers 
And um, run down a little story. I used to wear seven and a half. That's why I have so many of them. Then my head size changed, so I had to go to seven five eight. So some of these seven and a halfs never got a chance for me to wear them. But I do not like having the gold foil fifty nine fifty stickers on. So I always took them off and spray down waterproof my hat. So that's why it does not have the sticker. But it is brand new, just without the sticker. And uh, but um. This is also done like the Seattle Mariners have I showed you in the beginning of the video. The C is flush, it's not in raised. Note, no new era logo, no major league logo. It does have a green underbill, white sweatband, seven and a half, new era, Cooperstown collection. This one we're gonna do for 15. Then we got an all blue Atlanta Braves hat. Just like the black murdered out hat, everything's done the same way, but all in roll blue, black underbill, seven to five. Oh, I'm sorry, seven and a half. Uh, new era official merchandise. I'm gonna do this for five bucks. Got the red version, exact same thing as the black and blue one. I'm just gonna try to run through this. Seven and a half, five bucks. This is what they would refer to as like a pinwheel. Style hat kind of reminds you of like how the uh, Montreal Expos used to do their color layout. But um, this has been worn maybe two times at the most. Carolina blue, white, if any logo, Major League logo, white and the Carolina blue, blue underbill, black sweatband, seven and a half, new era, official merchandise, five bucks. All right, this one's brand new dead stock, seven and a half. Atlanta Braves, black, the A's done in black, outline of white and red, red NE logo, Major League logo done in red, white, and black, black underbill, black sweatband, seven and a half, new era official merchandise. This is we're gonna do for 15. Alright, this one I'm gonna give away for free with a purchase of any of these hats. Uh, the reasoning when I moved, the button popped off the top. Don't know where the hell it went. But I'll, this is also seven and a half Philly Stars from the Negro League. Very, very nice hat. Doesn't appear I'll ever have worn it. But I'm gonna throw this in free with the purchase of any any hat that you've seen. Um, I will throw it in for free. All right, this is a Atlanta Braves hat. Has, if you look carefully, it's the Atlanta Braves A done sideways interlocking to try to resemble like a tribal type symbol it's a black hat the logo is done in black and outlined in like light, light gray any logo done in light gray major league logo on the back done in gray and black black underbill seven and a half new era official merchandise I'm doing this one for five bucks all right it's just like the white and carolina blue one you just saw but the white and gray version Doesn't look like I ever even, even wore this hat. You know what, hell, five bucks. I'm just trying to move these. All right, Atlanta Falcons. This is a Mitchell and Ness fitted. Very super nice hat. Seven and a half. This is brand new dead stock. Very rare, you're not gonna find this anywhere. Old school Falcons logo. Red button on top. Got the Mitchell and Ness logo down in cursor from the back. Very dope, red underbill. White sweatband with just Mitchell and Ness. Once again, seven and a half. Brand new dead stock, 15 bucks plus shipping. All right, this is another dead stock. Atlanta Flames uh, was a hockey team here in Atlanta back in the 70s and now up in Canada, now known as the Calgary Flames. Uh, red, logo done white, yellow and red. Any logo done in red to blend in. NHL logo down in red, yellow, and white. Black underbill, 758s, new era. NHL tagging, 15 bucks plus shipping. All right, this is a Reebok fitted, seven and a half. Atlanta Falcons done a royal blue with the current style logo. Reebok logo there, white button. NFL logo done in white, white underbill. Uh, like I may have wore it maybe once or twice. Blue sweatband, five bucks. All right, this is a custom Compton hat I had made at a Lids 
Um, it's, it was made on a, I think that's pronounced a Zypher blank, size seven and a half. Um, I wore it a few times. Very, very nice though. Uh, has the, the Zypher Z done in black, blended in, you can't see it. Nothing on the back. Black underbill, black sweatband. Five bucks. Alright, this is Nike fitted. Atlanta Falcons. Got the A on the front. NFL logo on the back with a little bit of like the stripe that you'd see on the helmet. Let's see, I have two of these actually. All right, this one's never been worn, 10 bucks. This one's identical to it, it's been worn, five bucks. Got the Washington Redskins version. Once again, this is a Nike, seven and a half. Same layout as the Falcons. NFL logo with a little striping. This one has been worn, five bucks. Dallas Cowboys version. Exact same as the other ones. It's like I might wore it once or twice, five bucks. And we got the Minnesota Vikings. This is a Reebok fitted, seven and a half. Never wore this one, but still five bucks. All right, that's all the hats. Let's move these. If you want to do a, a size seven and a half mystery box, let's see what would be a, a hell of a steal. See, we got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. All right, on the seven and a half hats, we can do a mystery box with twelve hats, fifty bucks shipped in the U.S. Can't beat it. I'll randomly put ten hats. I'm sorry. I'll randomly put 12 hats in the box, 50 bucks shipped, but it's to U.S. only, and I'm not going to give you 10 crap hats. You know, I'll I'll, I'll include some of the the new dead stock ones in there. If you want to do a mystery box, once again, 50 bucks for a, a, a dozen of the seven and a half shipped. If you want to do a, a mystery box on the seven and five eights. I'll do six of the seven and five eights that were featured in the beginning of the video for 75 bucks shipped. And once again, all the seven and five eights are all brand new dead stock. These seven and a half, a few of them were brand new dead stock. Most of them are considered used. Um, let's see. I have a total of. I think. Four of the seven and a half are brand new, and the rest are all considered used. So, I have my Facebook and Instagram info down in the description. DM me on any hats you're interested in. I accept PayPal. Please send it friends and family. Make sure you message me. We'll set up a, um, the transaction for whatever hats you want. Um, to make it easier, if you can, snap um, screenshots on your phone of which hats you want, um, if it's a whole bunch, to make it easier for me to figure out um, which ones to pull aside. And once again, if you want to do a mystery box in the seven and a halfs, I'll send you a dozen seven and a half fitteds for 50 bucks shipped. And if you want to do a seven to five eighths mystery box, those are all brand new dead stock. We'll do six of those for 75 shipped. All right, I hope everybody enjoyed this video. Please give a big thumbs up if you did. Subscribe down below if you haven't already. Trends Unlimited merch down in the description. Look forward to hearing from everybody. The last sale, we did very well. I really want to move these seven and a half and get in this, just get them out of the way. They're taking up space. So please hit me up. Till next time, it's your boy Infamous C, the ATL Don, signing out. Peace. I go rock it to the left, I go rock it to the right, I go rock it to the back, either way it's looking tight. She like, come on baby, give me that. You're looking good in that fitted. I got all colors, all teams, all crisp, all mean, cocked up with a lean, brand new. Now I mean, so fresh, so clean, gotta rock the ice cream, flood the mess with a guest. Now you see that ice gleam, white stitch, see the seam, Celtics, white and green, come through with white and blue. Yankees, the match of jeans.